Hello, and welcome back to the speed sketch. Um, so, spoilers. Normally, I have to uh, force people to give me suggestions. Usually we'll get like one or two, and then I like demand a third one. People decided to uh, go a little bit nuts and uh, suggest six different things to which I have condensed down into this. Um, Joe is specifically suggesting something that would get me banned. So I'm definitely not gonna do that. But uh, yeah, this is the goal for today. So let's, uh, let's get started on this. Let me go ahead and save the file real quick. We're gonna call this, let's just call this Gay Pug. This is Gay Pug. Joe, I'm not gonna attempt it. I'm just gonna put that out there. I'm not tempting it. <clears throat> okay, so let's go ahead and just get into it. So we're gonna go back to normal view. I think I'm gonna do all of the, I'm gonna do all of the material last. We're gonna do just all materials last. And let's get going. So, uh, we're going to start with the snow globe. Snow globe's nice and easy, right? Pretty pretty standard fare, if I would say so myself. And then we'll get into the big stuff afterwards. Um, I definitely have to apply scale if I want that to work. So, we got this. Bevel. Um, I believe Simo is joining us for this speed sketch. So, um... I guess I'm gonna look forward to seeing that because this one's gonna ruin Simo, I imagine. This one's gonna ruin me probably as well. There we go. That's a nice little place to put a uh, put a globe. Boom. That's our base, easy, problem solved. Let's go ahead and put on a UV sphere. Oh, my object or my origin point is super screwy right now, but um, we're just going to go for it. Ideally, I kind of want this thing to be big. This is more of a crystal ball, isn't it? Snow globes don't look like this. Snow globes are flat. My bad. So we actually want to cut this thing like that. We got ourselves a nice little cut snow globe, put it on there, bada boom. We're gonna go ahead and shade it smooth and we're going to subsurface it twice. Why not? Do I need to? No, but I really want that smooth curve. I don't care if it's doing that on top, who cares? And we're gonna add a solidify of basically no thickness, that's fine. Okay, next, we need to make a pug. A uh, pug. Pug, pug, pug is going to be the hardest thing in the entire universe. I'm going to kind of guess what a pug looks like. I'm going to make a Minecraft pug. I'm making a Minecraft pug. <clears throat> Anybody who's upset by that? Sorry. Minecraft pug. Okay, so a Minecraft pug. This might turn out adorable. Yeah, I mean, I'm just going for like my best chance, right? And I think Minecraft is going to be my best chance with what I've been given here. So we're going to pop these guys out. And that's fine as is. These guys probably need to be pushed back a little bit. Oh no, forward. We want to make like a shoulder joint, right? Pugs have really stumpy tails, if I remember correctly. I believe a pug's tail is just like a little puff that comes out the back. And it like curls kind of gross. Pugs are not the coolest dogs. Um, so everybody that likes pugs, I apologize. I, I don't really apologize. They're kind of gross and they have a bunch of genetic problems. And the fact that people breed them is kind of really regrettable. Um, pugs are kind of messed up, man. To no fault of their own. They're just kind of not good animals. 
Okay, so that should do just fine. They're some of the least favorite dogs, uh, but not their fault. Yeah, <laughs> totally. I feel precisely the same way. Like, if there's a pug that's wandering around on the street and uh, it needs some love, absolutely. Absolutely. I, I would love to help a pug, right? No problem. They're an animal. I care about animals. I love animals. I'm very compassionate in that way. It, I just realized people cannot say that I'm very compassionate. That's like the fakest thing you can do. So maybe I'm not compassionate. I'm just a guy. Uh, but I would take care of a pug if I had to. I just don't want to. There we go. That's what a pug's tail looks like as far as I'm concerned. That might be a little bit too long to be a pug's tail, but uh, what do I care, right? It's a Minecraft pug. Now, <clears throat> pugs have a fun little thing that they like to do, as far as I remember. They stick their little legs out like this. So I'm gonna grab you and merge you at last. Oh gosh, I just realized that I have to make this pug like as adorable as possible. Um, so I have a really good idea of how I'm gonna do that. Oh, I have such a good idea. I have such a crazy good idea now. I have such a good idea. Oh, I know what I'm gonna do. Okay. It's gonna require a lot of time. So I need to go extra fast. We're gonna go extremely fast. <clears throat> Whatever I just swallowed is, I can still feel it. It like scratched the heck out of my throat. <coughs> if I have to take a little break, that doesn't count towards my time. I'm just gonna call that right now. There we go, that's a pug. That's a pug. Now, if we're feeling extra weird, I believe that this is probably gonna sell the idea. Oh, no, 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 no. This is gonna sell the idea, right here. We pop this up and back just a little bit. Yeah, boom, look at that. You might even want to take it and go one step further. Come on, come on. One go one step further and I'm gonna add a cut right here, just like that. And we're gonna go ahead and merge at last, merge at last, okay? <coughs> and I can dissolve this and we can call it. Okay, cool, so that's a pug. Look at him, he's great. Now we need to make the head. So the head of a pug looks like, you know what? The more I look at this, the more I'm like, these just merge. There's more I wanted to do with the shoulders, but uh, I don't care. I'm gonna maybe add paws later, but for the time being, this is it. So they extrude up they rotate forward and it gets really small just on that axis, just like that, okay? <clears throat> they have this huge like hump on their back as far as I remember. Okay, and we should be able to just dissolve this now and extrude it forward one more time Rotate it like that. Nope, not like that. Rotate it like that, make it bigger. Down. And extrude along normals. Boom, that's a pug's head. That's what a pug looks like. <laughs> it looks kind of eldritch. It looks kind of like a nightmare, a little bit. Um, I think I can fix that by fixing the neck up a little bit, like that. Okay. Let's 
Let's push all this back. I'll be departing. See you later. Catch you later. I'll be posting uh, the final result on Discord as per the norm. So uh, don't worry about that. Okay, so you look at this and you're like, what an abomination I have made. Um, now I gotta make the face. And the face is a struggle. And the face is what I'm gonna spend the most time doing. So first things first, let's make the ears. Um, I should actually probably look up what a pug looks like. I debated it for a little bit, but I'm gonna do it right now. Oh, they are cute though, aren't they? They have such, no, I'm not gonna finish that sentence, Never mind. I was gonna say something really disagreeable about a pug, uh, but I'm good. A pug is a pug, a pug's a dog, it's a breed of dog. Okay, so uh, let's go into object, let's grab picture of pug. There he is. Look at this little guy. Okay, so we want ears. So his, his head is actually kind of the worst head in the world of dogs. Because um, it goes like this. They got like a weirdo square head. And if I grab these two and I plug them in just a little bit, that's a pug's face. All of this, and then we plug in some ears. I'm actually gonna need that uh, cross section anyway, so it's gonna work out literally perfect for us. Now, the ears have that really nice curve to them. I cannot do that curve. I don't have that ability. Hello? Okay. This is weird. You know, we'll do it just like that. That's fine, I don't care. Okay, let's go ahead and extrude those out. And we're gonna flop them on down and forward just a little bit and rotate them. So that is what the pug looks like. And now you just take it upon yourself to uh, merge all this together. And I believe that should do the job. That looks too much like a normal dog. It does not look dopey enough for me. So I'm gonna grab it and probably try and fix this like that. Down. And let's grab the bottom end of this and scooch that back and up. Okay. I think that's as good as I can get the ears, if I'm being perfectly honest. So we're gonna go ahead and just do the face now. Um, here's what we're up to. It's looking really cute, actually. Don't encourage it. Don't encourage it, because it only has the ability to get worse. Yeah, the ears do a lot for it. But most animals, I'm sure you know this, I'm sure you have like a pretty good grasp on all of this. You're probably a much more profound artist than I am when it comes to this sort of stuff. But um, in my experience, like, oh yes. In my experience, the thing that really like sells everything is usually only like a single detail. Like you'll make a person and it's like the way you do the nose or the way you like make the hair come over one of the eyes or something. It's like, that's always the distinguishing feature. Okay, that'll do, I guess. And now we gotta make a mouth, which, uh, oh, by the way, Joe, if you're here, Joe, if you're watching, um, V, that's what I was showing you on um, Discord. You press V and you can rip a vertice instead of having to um, make a separate one. Oh, Joe left. Let's mourn the loss of Joe for just a moment here. Uh, we're gonna J that, J that. Joe, you're extra sassy today. You doing okay? You're either you're either happy or you're sad, and I can't tell which one it is.
Okay, that's that's my best attempt at making a pug as fast as possible. I just get upset about the general lack of, uh, yep, I'm not gonna read that word out loud. Honestly, I'm glad you're upset about that because you deserve <laughs> to be upset about that. There we go. Does that look a little bit more Eldritch Nightmare? Yeah, it does, actually. Oh, he looks so bad. Oh, he looks so gross. He looks like a weird pig. Oh, he looks so, so abominable. You know what? I need to fix this part. Can you not leave him square-y? Um, I mean, I can put a subsurface on him, but I think that's only going to make matters worse. But I'll give it a shot. Why not, right? What's it going to bother? So let's go ahead and just pop out those shoulders just a little bit. Nope, let's not do that. Oh, he's such an abomination. Okay, so here's the only fast solution. Oh, also, let me do one thing real quick while we're here. Um, I'm going to grab this nose, subdivide it, grab both of those, dissolve, and we're going to make nostrils, individual. Oh, he really does look like a pig. He does just look like a pig. Okay, sure, whatever. Sure, whatever. <laughs> oh no. I'm gonna give him eyes in a moment. The eyes are gonna do it, but um, here we go. I mean, is it better? It might be a little bit better. Okay, sure, whatever. This is gonna have to do. I need to. I need to move on. Um, let's give him two eyes real quick, and we're gonna come back to the eyes in just a second. Um, I'm gonna totally spoil things for you guys. The eyes. I'm going to rush. <laughs> And me rushing the eyes is going to turn them into monstrosities. But uh, I don't have time. This is what happens when I have six different prompts that I have to um, juggle in one sesh. Where'd I put that sphere? Where'd I put that sphere? There it is. Okay, let's do that. Pop the eye on into his socket. Pugs kind of have the grossest eyes in the world. There we go. <laughs> he looks kind of like an idol at the end of Legends of the Hidden Temple, um, which I love. Which I really love about this guy. Okay, we're gonna call that eyes. We're gonna call this body. And then everything else is fine to stay as it is. Oh gosh, okay. Focus, 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 focus. Oh my good God. Oh my good God, we've made a boy. Let's add a... Please, please, please. Um, cylinder. Oh my gosh. We're gonna run out of time so fast. This is gonna be this is gonna be such a tragedy. Okay, make you super, super tall and long, skinny, tall, long, skinny, tall, long. Okay. There's that. Make sure it ends up in his paws correctly, and let's give it a little bit of a slant. As I've impaled this little doggo. We'll do that. And 
and a little bit more of a slant is going to be required. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Freaking out. Okay, there he is, there he is. He's got a little flag. Now we need to just add a cube. And by cube, I meant a plane. Plane is going to be rotated 90 degrees. And let's do this. Please, 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 please. You got it. So we want to rotate very carefully here. Just very careful. Actually, what am I doing? I messed up. Make it a flag first. There we go. That's probably not the correct dimensions for a flag, but uh, I can't be bothered to care. So that is our flag. If I remember correctly, flags are normally like nine by five. I used to be very into flags. I did a lot of research on flags for a long time, but uh, I fell off of that. More uh, more of my writing stuff became more important to me and I just stopped caring about flags. Um, but I do know a lot about flags, so I will be applying it into my writing as I go. But uh, for the time being, it ain't, it ain't the most important thing in the world. Now, if I had the ability, I would put an adornment on the top of the flag. Don't get me wrong, I would. I don't have that ability right now. I don't have time for that. I can't do that. So we're not. Rainbow. One, two, three. Oh gosh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Pride flag. How many colors are on a pride flag? How many colors are in a rainbow? One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Goodness me. One, two, three, six. One, two, three, one, two, three. That's six, perfect. That'll do. Okay, and um, I kind of want to take all that and divide it one more time, just like that. Put it into sculpt and you already know what we're gonna do. We're gonna get just the end of this guy going. Actually, you know what would be better? If I go to object mode and I apply scale and we go back to sculpt mode and now we give it a little bit of a wave. Come on. Come on. Come on. I know you want to. There we go. Boom, we got ourselves a nice wave and a little flag. Okay, cool. Um, I don't have time to think about this too, too hard, but I do need to actually know this up right now because I have forgotten what I just did. So we're gonna go ahead and grab the pride flag. We're going to go into edit mode. We're going to do a new one. This is material one. We're gonna call you red. And then they're all going to be red moving forward. One, two. Slot two, assign, assign. One, two, slot three, assign. One, two, slot four, new, assign. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm freaking out. Um. You, yes, and assign. And last but not least, please. Okay, so if I've done it correctly, I can go to slot one. I can go to red. I can make it right red. What are the colors of a pride flag? It goes red, orange. Okay, it starts with red, goes down. Red to orange. Uh, slot two is orange. Slot three is yellow. Slot four is green. You know what's really sad about the pride flag? 
Wait, is it only a five? No, it does have six. Okay. What's really sad about the pride flag is it doesn't recognize cyan, and cyan is the best color. So um, that's like a real shame. That's a real no-no, I would say, on the uh, pride flag. But uh, sure, it should have seven, and it should have cyan right there. And that would do that would do wonders for it. Okay, so we've got a pride flag. He's done it. Uh, I can go ahead and do some quick little stuff. We're gonna do a Q wood right there. We can do a Q metal right here. We can grab this and make this glass with uh, almost completely see-through. Okay, that'll do. The pug, we will get to the pug. Okay, so I have seven minutes. Oh gosh, I only have seven minutes. Um, what else did I have to do? Snowflakes. Let's make some snowflakes. Oh gosh, snowflakes. How the heck am I gonna do snowflakes? Um, when I think snowflakes, I'm thinking to myself, we want this. We're gonna want Z45. No, we want Y45. Okay. And now I push it on back, push it on there, squinch it down. We go boom, boom. And actually, instead, I want to do three, three. And now we're going to grab two of them and make these guys smaller. Just like that is a real nice looking snowflake. And now I can grab just these guys and we can do this and we can bridge faces. It's gonna bridge all the faces. I don't wanna do that. I wanna bridge just these guys. Okay. That is not the worst looking snowflake I've ever seen in my life. Um, that's actually pretty cool looking. Let's go ahead and put a subsurface on there. Like that. And then that looks terrible now. Actually, I kind of liked it better low poly. We're gonna keep it low poly. Um, what I want to do though, is I wanna grab you, 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 you. And we want to expand these out. And we wanna make them thin, real thin. We can go ahead and grab these guys and bring them out like that. And then I will connect all of them. It's a cool snowflake. Thank you. Very appreciated. I, uh, I'm just going as fast as my brain can handle. I don't really have time to look up references or anything. So I'm just kind of, this is, this is me. This is all I got. <laughs> oh no, I hate, it has a drill bit in the center of it. Uh, sure. Sure. Whatever. You think I care? Okay. Let's get rid of the sphere. And let's pop the pug and flag on into here. Please, sir. Gives it character, for sure. I mean, at the end of the day, you just gotta do what you gotta do. You can't you can't think too much about stuff. That's, a, that's terrible advice. Nobody should ever follow that advice. Um, I'm just kind of talking out of my butt right now, but sure. Okay, we got a pug. We're gonna go ahead and put the sphere on. I'm gonna go ahead and put on a little bit of see-throughness. Oh, he looks good. He looks good. Scale that way down. Copy paste. Copy paste. Copy paste. You did this so fast. I mean, I've been like, Burning up in the crucible lately. I've been, I've been, you know, cutting my teeth on this. Honestly, being forced to make things quickly teaches you a lot. I think a lot of artists should do this. Is it stressful? Yeah. I mean, I can't, I just can't take it seriously. I can't like, I can't think about what I'm doing too, too much. Otherwise I get like kind of disappointed. But, um, 
that's kind of the point, right? Okay. You know what? That's enough snowflakes, I think. So we're going to go ahead and use nodes. Look how good that looks. Okay, so get rid of the spear. What do I have? Three minutes? No problem. No problem. Three minutes? Who cares? You think I care about three minutes? We're going to do a little bit of icicle blue, which is cyan, which is not recognized by the gay flag, unfortunately. We're going to do that. Roughness on this comes down. Specular is super high. Sheen is high. Clear coat's high. That's it. Snowflake. Pug, snowflake, uh, snow globe, what else? LGBT flag, yes. And a surprise for Joe. Oh gosh, I forgot the surprise for Joe. Joe, what did you, you suggested something. Joe suggested something. Joe, what did you suggest instead of um, the first thing that you suggested that I'm not gonna say out loud? <clears throat> yeah, other than that thing, what did you suggest? A judge wig. That's right. That's right. That's what you that's what you said. Oh, I don't know if I even have time to be thinking about your other thing. They have this like gross white color, don't they? Like that. And it's like super rough. And it's got sheen out the wazoo. Give him a gavel? I'm okay with a gavel. I can live with a gavel. I'll take a gavel any day. We're gonna go ahead and put on a bump and I guarantee we're gonna go over time. So I'm gonna admit that I'm going over time right now. I apologize. Simo, you have a little bit of extra time. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and pop on a noise texture. Very specifically, we want a noise. Because we wanna throw this distortion super high. That might be a little too high. <laughs> he looks so eldritch. He looks horrific. He looks pretty scary. Oh, gosh. You know what? I think we're just going to lower the strength a lot. There we go. It looks a little bit better. That looks much better. Much, much better. Yep, now it almost looks a little bit like hair. <sighs> oh no! He's awful looking. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so the eyes. Now the eyes are tough. I had a lot of ideas for the eyes and I'm realizing I don't really have time to sit and work on them. Hey Streamlabs? Why is Streamlabs just posting all of its messages all at once? That's not how it was set up. Okay, sure. The eyes are gonna be metallic because I'm bad, because I'm not good at what I'm doing. But um, we're gonna make the eyes very precious with uh, a Fresnel. Actually, we're gonna do a Fresnel mixed with a object, coordinate, gradient, or even a camera. Oh, 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 yep, 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 yep. Uh, camera gradient, this is it. This is it, this is gonna be so good. Get ready for this. Window. So he should theoretically follow us, he's not. It's kind of a real shame. There we go. Come on. Okay, so he kind of follows us a little bit. So that is definitely part of it. And now we're gonna do a color spectrum here. 
Okay, and now I'm going to mix these two together. So what do I get when I do this? Yep, more of a normal result. Actually, we'll just stick with the quadratic. Quadratic's fine. So I'm gonna do this. We're gonna go to HSV. I'm gonna grab a red. And we're going to grab a purple. And we're gonna go far. Now he's got these weirdo little rainbow eyes that uh, look kind of scary. In fact, I might just get rid of this and go full rainbow on the eyes. Hmm. It's not working as much as you wanted to. You know what? Instead, he is hypnotized. I don't care. I'm making a judgment call real quick. He's hypnotized. Um, so we're going to put the vector on here. Please, 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 sir. Okay, so he's got Z-aligned eyes or Y-aligned eyes. No. The heck is happening? I've lost it. There we go. Now he's trippy as can be. Hypnotism is fine, but uh, whatever else isn't, you know. Joe, I'm not having this. Okay, so that is him. We put the sphere back on, we're good. I'm three minutes over time. So I'm gonna say that that is... Yeah, you'll cut it out. No, you're fine, Joe. You, I'm, I'm, we're, having, we're having a great time, don't you worry. So what else am I missing? The surprise for Joe. What was the surprise for Joe supposed to be? Because I, I vaguely remember having the surprise for Joe, but I forgot what it was going to be. Also, I wanted to make these eyes way more interesting, but I don't have time. I just genuinely don't have time for it. So I'm having trouble remembering what the last little bit of this was supposed to be. Which is a real shame. If I had more time, I think I would color him with texture paint just manually. But I think that's about it. Tell you what, Joe, I'm gonna try and make a wig for you. Um, just because I love you dearly. So here you go, here's your wig. The rainbow eyes look cool. I appreciate you saying that. I don't know if I would agree. Oh no, no, I'm doing something else. Joe doesn't ever get what Joe wants. Joe's not allowed. Joe, Joe suggested things that I, I'm not willing to say on stream, so Joe's going to get whatever Joe gets. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're going to subdivision this three times, make it nice and dense. We're going to pop on like six of these guys. Try to get yourself banned and you haven't done it yet. Yeah, that's basically the rhythm. I mean, you are a mod. I've seen you attempt to ban yourself before. Okay. It doesn't work. I would love to ban you one day but I think it would have like not very good consequences, so I'm not going to. I think it would look bad on the channel. I think it would like just be kind of weird on Twitch's end. So I'm not gonna do it. Now you might be asking, what the heck am I doing? Um, I'm asking myself that same question. I'm sort of having a moment right now what the moment is, I couldn't be sure yet. <laughs> Look at this awful thing I've just made. Okay, so we all know what this is, right? 
This is awful. This is, oh, this, oh, this is the judge. This is the judge who, um, this is the judge who made uh, gay marriage legal. It was Judge Pug, Pug Sphere. I hear if you have a nipple slip, then you can get banned. Honestly, Joe, now you, now you know. I've been waiting for that. There we go, now we're back. How to know person. I can't nipple slip on Red's channel. I mean, you could find where I live. Right? And then you could do it. Okay, this is wig. This is a wig. It's a wig and it is no saturation gray. Yep, it's perfect. And the scale is one. If that's not banned, uh, territory. It's definitely restraining territory. I mean, sure. I'd love to sue you. Okay. So, uh, this is about as good as I can expect it to be right now. Um, am I happy with this? No. <laughs> Not at all. This looks cursed. Um, let's change our world settings real quick, and then, uh, I'm gonna call it. We're done. So we're gonna want to grab the HDRI for cliffs. It's the one I normally like to use. It's a little dark. Let's use uh, something a little bit higher. That should be a bit better. And here's what we're looking at. So we got ourselves a nice little pug. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and make the snow globe even more clear and then I'm done. Simo, how's it looking for you? I think, I think you might have just posted in the Discord if I'm seeing my phone correctly. I've never heard of another man doing that. It would be an interesting news article. If only you lived in Florida. Fun fact, I do live in Florida. I myself do live in Florida. There it is. Now, I hate to do it. I'm going to take the wig out. It doesn't work. This is, this is our setup right now. So that's it. That's what I've made. What a strange stream it's been. Ugh. Make sure to take a stretch, everybody. It's very good for you. It'll feel very good. It'll make you feel very clean and very open as a human being. But this is it. This is what you can expect from uh, the likes of me. All right, Simo. We're gonna call it here real soon. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and set up my camera while we wait. I think my camera's actually looking pretty decent. So we're gonna GZ this guy on up. We're going to GY him just a little bit backwards. Right about there. And I'm going to RX just a little bit down. And that is my scene, done. Are we satisfied with this? Is this is this acceptable? Can we live with this? Man, it's haunted. If we're waiting on SEMO, if I'm gonna wait just a moment on SEMO, then I'm gonna take it upon myself to actually texture paint the, um, the doggo. So let me grab this glass real quick. Grab the dog. We're gonna pop on a image texture. Make a new one, just like that. And then I'm going to go into here, go to UVs, come on. Texture paint. Where are you at? Texture paint, what am I looking for? Oh, it's a mode, Never mind. You are ready? Okay, well, I've devoted to this, so give me one second. Um, okay, I mean, it, it doesn't want to texture paint. This always happens. Why does this always happen every time I do this? It's because I have a bump attached, correct? So if I go back to texture paint... No, never mind. No texture painting for me. 
So I am also done. So with that, I will call it. Thank you all for joining. Anybody who isn't a member of the Discord, please join the Discord linked in the bottom. Whether you're on YouTube or Twitch, it'll be linked in the bottom. Um, the Discord is where we post the final results for all this stuff. We have a lot of good advice that swims around, a lot of weird, I would, I would hesitate to call them memes. We're just kind of strange people in general. Um, for everybody that was here in chat, thank you very much. It was very lively, always very appreciated. Um, I will see you all on Friday. Good night to Chaos. Good night to everybody. Um, yeah, I don't think I have anything else to say. I'll see you all on Friday. And uh, hopefully I'll have some news on Friday as to this little project that I've been working on. But uh, we'll see when we get there. Who knows? Peace.